Hi guys, welcome along back. We've got Dave on fan cams. Uh, Dave, I messaged you to say, ask you if you were doing one, and you said, yeah, and how uh, mad you were at that game. I mean, it, it weren't a performance of a, what you need from a team that's down at bottom, were it that? Not at all. It's, it's, like, it's like deja vu, this. It's mm -hmm. like you've got the same questions for every single interview. Yeah. And I'm going to give the same answers for every interview. No, it's... It, again, it was shocking. Absolutely shocking. Mm. There's no words about it. I mean, there were no... There seemed to be no... I don't know. It's just team team selection, the tactics. The, you, you know, you can see it needs changing and nothing gets done about it again. It's almost... It is almost a carbon copy. We could use you one from Luton, I suppose. But, I mean... I've said to other lads before I've come on with you that like we needed to beat Luton, we needed to beat Wigan, and we've managed to get two points out of it. Uh, I mean, do you find that's it now for you? Would you call it or? I I I, I would have said yes after Luton because mm. um, you know we, we needed to beat Luton. I mean, we did and we didn't. And like I said in my in my last one, the, the last ten minutes was was good. You know, it was it, it was urgency. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we, we, looked, we looked like we were going to, you know, threaten the goal. We scored. Mm. And it, it, but it's the same every game. We just set off so laxy daisy and mm. uh, there's just, there's just no urgency. And I, I, I just run out of things to say now that I haven't said before. It's, yeah. it's just so frustrating. Yeah. So it's frustrating. It, it, yeah. I mean, what did you make to end when, uh, I don't know if you saw it end with some players who had got their heads in their hands and strew, but... You know, that, that were very, I couldn't believe it when Camber went to Struber and I saw him with his uh, hands on his knees, like, it's almost as if they've accepted it. I, as, as soon as the final whistle went, so I just I just switched off, I, I didn't see any of the, the after, but I, you know, I, was, I was that pissed off mm. with what I, I watched, I just couldn't watch anymore, I just had to get out of there and just <laughs> go outside, sit down, get a beer and just, you know, try and wind down and calm myself down a bit because... There was, there was, there was nothing there. It's, it, this was a massive, massive game. Yeah, absolutely massive, and there's, there was just no urgency. You know, there was. I really feel for for players like um, Styles putting a good shift today. Yeah, um, Samoa he, he put in a good shift. He really tried, and when Chaplin came on, he put in a good shift. But uh, we never looked like scoring. We no. never ever looked like scoring. Even when they went down to ten men as well, which there was no difference. Yeah, there was absolutely no difference. If, if anything, yeah. they, they look more threatening, if you ask me, on, on counter-attack. They, they had more possession yeah. before, before the red card. They didn't do anything with it either. You know, mm. they didn't look like scoring. Mm. But after, after the red card, we had all the possession, but we didn't do anything with it. Mm. You know, there was, there was no urgency. You come out to the 90th minute, and I put it back and forth from the halfway line. If they can get the ball forward, do something. Mm. Uh, I, I was taking the time with it and all that. We're screaming. It's, you, yeah. You're screaming at Terry, aren't you? You're just like, what What? What am I seeing? Why, why does it seem like, how can they not see what predicament, can they not understand what predicament we're in and stuff like that? I mean, going on um, set pieces as well. How many have we had today and done absolutely mm. nothing? Well corners that can't beat the first man you know if, if, you, if, if you can't get a ball into the area that can't beat the first man then you know that you, you've got no hope really if you, you've got to change that for a start yeah I know Moet's set pieces have been questionable over the last couple of games and Ritz, some of Ritzmeyer's corners today were okay mm. but it's, it's it's just no creativity from anywhere mm. you know a, a, apart from Styles, you know Styles down the left towards the end of the game especially uh, Chaplin when he came on he, he, you know he looked, he looked dangerous he looked Capable of setting something up, mm. but he sets something up, but then there's no one there to capitalise on. There's no one in the area. Mm. No, there never is. It's usually the bands away. Uh, what did you make uh, to uh, Woodrow when he was substituted? Questions ringing about him and the body language, all this and that. I mean, it was poor, wasn't it? I, I felt I, the body language to me looked like you know he he, he don't feel the same as what me and you do for the club. Well, Luke messaged me on um, was it Wednesday or Thursday after he did that mm. um, little snippet on on the Barnsley website, mm. and uh, I knew he was furious about his his, um, his attitude of what he was saying. And I watched it and I was like, he just he just doesn't seem like he's got any interest. Mm. I think he's got another deal sorted out somewhere else. I think as soon as the season's over, his agents lined him up with a move to you know somewhere else, you know maybe a Blackburns or a Prestons or someone like that. And yeah, I, yeah. Think he's, I think I think he's got something sorted out, and he just doesn't care anymore. Yeah, 
I mean, for me, I mean, he's not done anything in them games. But I think there's a couple of others in there that, you know, you've got to question them as well. But I think that goes back to a, man a manager thing, the tactics and all this and that. I, I, I can't work Struber out sometimes. I really, really can't. And we did the preview of, um, of, of whether it's uh, like a, uh, this with the foreign managers coming in and that, that's their philosophy. They're sticking to it. I mean, do you see it as a sort of arrogance thing? They're not going to change. Quite possibly. Um, at the end of the day, we need someone that knows the EFL. Mm. We need someone that knows it, especially in the championship. Yeah. You need an experienced head. You need, I don't know, um, even a Mick McCarthy, sort of, mm. someone that knows the league, mm. someone that's got the contacts to bring players in. And um, I, I mean, I don't know what say Struber's got over buying these players. We I mean, you know whether Mr. Bean and his. Excel spreadsheets <laughs> is saying, well, we'll we'll get um, so and so from FC Austria, mm. or or whatever. You know, it, it it doesn't work. You you need to have a manager that knows the league. You need to have a manager that can pick his own players, mm. and he needs free reign. Mm. And uh, now go on, go on, Dave. Go on, you finish. Uh, 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 say, you saw this with Cardiff when Tam took over at Cardiff. Yeah, you know, he, he was the big man there. He, he made all the big decisions. He brought in the managers. He brought in, he had to say all the transfers. And apart from the, the season they got promoted the first time around to the Premier League, it didn't work out. They got they got relegated. He went for weak managers like um, Russell Slade, mm. and it, it and brought in rubbish players. It didn't work, mm. and fans were walking away. He, he changed the colour of the team. Fans walked away, and um, there was protests and everything. And eventually, he thought, well, this isn't working. You know, the fans are leaving in droves. Mm. We're languishing in the, the, the bottom half of the, the championship. Something's got to change. And he's gone to Neil Warnock. And Warnock's come in and he said, give me reins over the team and I'll get you out of this. And that's exactly what he did. Mm. He brought in players like Sol Bamba. He brought in Junior Hoylet. Experienced mm. heads at this level. You know, they might be in their 30s. It's experienced heads. Mm. You know they know this league, and they can do they can do the business, yeah. and it, it's shown what they can do. And we've got this policy now where you can't you know sign players over a certain age. And he's gone to Eastern Europe for, for his players, and it, it doesn't work. It doesn't it's, work. You no. need to leave the football side of things to people that know the football side of things. Mm. You can't do this on spreadsheets. It doesn't work that way. Yeah, hundred Dave, hundred percent. We've said it all along. And you look at the players, you know, and the managers that's been available before Struber came in. We could have gone for. The, they, they won't come here because I don't think the board will ever change. They'll, they'll not change their style, their philosophy and what they believe. I think, you know, I can't imagine Neil Warnock would never come here if, if he couldn't have a say over the players. Mick McCarthy, same, because they're old school. But like you said, they know the league and that's what we should have been looking for all along. All this going abroad and looking for these managers, it, 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 you know what I mean? It don't work. I think, you know, in League One with Daniel Stender, we played some good football, but league, that's League One, the championship. You know, it's it's almost a second Premier League, the tactical side of it. You know, you've got to know what to do in certain games, when it needs changing, when what's the right time to make a sub, see a game out, that sort of thing. And, yeah, I think, I think for me, there's been times like with Struber that it just seems like tactically it's just not, not worked. He doesn't have, he doesn't have a clue. I don't think he knows what he's doing, really. Mm. I don't even know how, how, how much in charge he really is. Mm. You know, whether Conway and, you know, Chinley are saying to him, like, pick this team, play these players. Mm. You know, it's, it's it's just completely baffling. The team selection, you know, the tactics, we, we discuss this all the time. Yeah. It's, if, if you know football, you wouldn't, you wouldn't pick these players based on the way they've been performing. Mm. And, if things are going as bad as they are at the moment, you change things around. It's you know, it's it's it's, it's common knowledge. That's what you yeah. do, and he's not doing it. So is he being told he's got to do this? Is he is he being told you've got to play Ritzmeyer? Well, I mean, somebody. I don't know what. It's either that or he really does perform in training, or like a lot of people have said on social media. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna bring him up, but like oh, Ritz Myers so and so, wish through, blah 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 blah. But that is probably. I mean, I've seen some players down down the years, and I don't like calling them out and everything like that. But do, do you know what though, Dave? I don't blame Ritz Meyer himself. It's not his fault that he's in that starting eleven. I think he's had a couple of good games, Ritz Meyer. To be honest, I think he was he was all right against Luton. I think it really were, uh, and I, I suppose that justifies him playing today. But I don't think it justifies him getting ninety minutes again. 
No, no. Because but then, it's obviously, the team that started against Luton, it's, you know, he's, 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 for me, my best player against, against Luton was, um, was um, Chaplin. Mm. And he's, he's not started Chaplin. It's, I, 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 that was the biggest shock for me when I saw the team sheet. I was like, Chaplin not playing. He put in the most effort last mm. week and you've dropped him. Well, that, yeah, well, I'd have took Brown. I, 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 before I saw it, I'd, it'd have been Brown out for me. I think Brown would have come out and I'd have kept Chaplin in. That would have been my team. Brown, he's, he's, I've, I've tried not to slate him. I really haven't. He, he just put a lot of effort in. Mm. But he's, he's gone down the right a few times today and his balls would have been absolutely dreadful. Mm. He's just not found anyone. He's found, he's found Wigan players every single time. Yeah. You know, he's, he, he, he's out of form. He's pretty out of confidence. You know, but who are you going to play down the right instead of him? Well, this is it, isn't it? This is it. I said to Luke, I said, well, have we got an out-and-out -out winger in this club? And it's Jordan Green, maybe, who's not even in squad. It's, I forgot it, about him. Yeah, it, about him. yeah. <laughs> that's it. Uh, there's, I don't know, mate. I don't know. But what will be, will be, I suppose. And we're not look, all the lads who I've just spoke to, they're not looking forward to uh, Thursday. I mean, who would be? It could, I well, think we could get an hiding, couldn't we? It's either going to be a hide-in or it's going to be a shock, I think. <laughs> I don't think it'll be a, a medium there. It's either going to be a hide-in like they gave Stoke on Thursday or it's mm. going to be a complete shock. And if it is a complete shock, I'm going to be in complete shock because <laughs> bar a couple of people today, I've just, I've just, I've just got no faith in the players. Mm. No faith at all. No, and, and, and nobody will blame me for not having any Dave either because we've watched them all season and, uh, yeah, it's not changed, so... All right then, mate. Well, uh, thanks for coming on, um, and I'll speak to you probably over Facebook uh, leading up to the game, and I'll uh, probably see you on Zoom afterwards if uh, if we can bear it. <laughs> I'll be there in one form. I'll be there in one form. Yeah. Uh, all right then, mate. Well, thanks for coming on, and I'll speak to you later on. All right, buddy. Take it easy. Yeah. Same to you, mate. Bye. Ta da, mate. Ta da.